Hey, hey, here's a quick demo of the brand new Flywire Connectome Data Explorer, AKA Codex. It is an easy to use tool that lets you explore the reconstructions and connections and annotations from Flywire. So to just get started, we'll do a little demo here with an LPSP neuron. It is really one of my favorite neurons. It's this really cool fan-shaped cell of the central brain. Um, so once you type in the cell of interest into the search bar, you get this little snapshot window. So there's an interactive 3D viewer. Um, there's some information about the cells, which we'll get to in a sec. There's visual uh, overview of primary input, output, uh, hemispheres, neurotransmitters, neural pills. There's also this interactive network graph of individual cells. So you can see all the primary input, output, neural pill as well as the number of connections and you can use this graph to jump to any of the the neurons from uh, both input and output it'll load the the preview page for those individual cells so if I go back to here back to this uh, LPSP neuron you can also in related under this related cell section you can see all of the upstream neurons uh, that have more than five connections and all the downstream neurons so I'll just load both of those up uh, in this page you can sort of see the search results overview as well as download these results as a CSV down the cell IDs or view the cell matches in Flywire. Now I'll do this for upstream and downstream so we can check these out as they load after they load in the background. Um, it's loading static data so it's faster than regular Flywire. Um, you can also see similar cells, uh, cells with similar neuropill projection and also similar neuropill projection in opposite hemispheres. Codex also has this explore page where you can kind of get a snapshot of the whole data set. So there's different classes of cells uh, that you'll see here. We will be breaking sensory down into uh, the different senses. Uh, there's also some curated collections of groups of neurons in here. Uh, there are annotations from the community, lots of annotations from the community, but here's a snapshot of some of the most common ones, uh, as well as max in out neuropill groups. So you can you, you can check out the FAQ for how to format your search uh, to look within here so you can you know try to find, you know, specify your input and output neuropill to find uh, you know individual neurons or groups of neurons of interest. Uh, Flywire is in uh, Flywire Codex is in a closed alpha, which means that only people with production access to Flywire can access it. Uh, the next thing we're going to be adding is a credit system for annotations and, and proofreading credits. Um, but it's actively under development. This is really early phase. It's not going to be public until sometime in 2023. And we're sharing it early with the community because we would love to know what you would like to see. You know, what features do you want to see modified? expanded changed what would you like to be able to do with this that you can't currently do um, you know that's that's kind of where we are and we'll be listening and want to make a conversation of you know how to make this tool so that even people who don't code you know have a way that they can explore and make sense of of these data so lastly we'll just pop over to the um, up and downstream partners so upstream partners of that LPSB neuron you can see the the protocerebral bridge over there. And then downstream partners, you've got our little forbidden donut, the EPG ring right here. So hopefully with this tool, it will be really easy to find partners and pathways through the brain. Um, hope you enjoy it. Let us know what you think. Let us know how we can expand it and improve it. Uh, and thank you so much for all the work that you have put into Flywire. Um, it's been a labor of love by so many people and hopefully this is just the beginning of this new era of Connectomics, uh, all thanks to the collaboration of a global community of researchers. So thank you so much and see you online.